what is up guys it's jazzy faye and welcome back to my channel if you are new hi welcome i appreciate you for stopping by and if you haven't done so already consider subscribing so you can go ahead and continue to follow me on my financial journey of being debt free and just knowing where my money goes now in this channel i usually have focused on my videos being cash stuffing videos or bill exchanges but today i will go ahead and show you guys what i spend my money on so i will go ahead and go through the expense tracker and then go through my binders to unstuff some cash and pay myself back so if that's something that interests you or you want to see how that turned out just keep on watching all right so i'm gonna just bring out my bank envelope cash um this is basically stuff that goes back to the bank um and i'm bringing it out just to help in case i need any change when i go through my expense tracker um, but in here, we are starting off with $2,011. All right, so let's start off with looking at my expenses. Um, I keep my expenses in this little nice notebook. Um, this was actually one through a giveaway with Budget with Jeanette a while back. Um, it's just so pretty. I love it. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and check what I have. I already wrote it out and highlighted it. And then actually I had my sister do my um, calculations. So she did a pretty good job. But let me just like, give you guys a closer look. So this is how I'd keep my expenses. Um, this is for August. I put charge name. So how it shows up in my bank account. Charge amount. So this is the amount that it shows up as with the cents. Which envelope basically means where I'm taking it out of. Rounded amount is what I round it either up or down. The majority goes up. So a total amount that I should be adding into my cash already set up is $367. So we're going to go off of this. All right, let's start with this first binder. And let me put this over here. Okay. So nothing from rent so far, that can wait. Car, I do not need to make a payment either. Food, I do need to make a payment. So this one was a total of $89. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four dollars plus five. That's $9, and then 20, 40, 60, 80. So $89 from food. And now food still has 20, 40, 51. All right, gas is also getting a payment and it still has not gone down that's for sure so Costco is the way to go that's the only one I know well so far that I've seen is less than four dollars per gallon everything else is just ridiculous so gas is going to be taking a $40 hit which is not too bad and I still have 30 remaining Utilities, I have already made the payment for the month of August, does not need to be taken out. Waste management, it's every three months. I have not received the bill just yet. Okay, I don't know what is going on with my envelopes, but they've been getting real sticky. Um, so I'm probably gonna start looking for some new envelopes coming up. So let me know of any good ones that you guys like, any you know i support i love supporting small businesses so i wanted to keep a theme and keep it all together all the same but at this point they're just so pretty all over the place you know and i can't just pick one theme so i'm gonna check some out but up next i know chirin also was used so for chirin i did um buy some stuff at costco as well at foodsco so some snacks and stuff so that was a total of 
Let me see if I have. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. So that's nine and then a 20. Perfect. Sharon now has $50 remaining. Yeesh. Right. I remember when this had a large amount, but that was before Aaliyah was born. Now that she's here, there's a lot more uh, purchases going on. Beauty also has some money to be taken out. Um, I bought some nail stuff as well as some... Um, makeup organizers and all that so that came out to a total of 30 so 20 and 10 so beauty now has 20 40 60 70 80 85 86 dollars all right health did not get used big event either and taxes do not get touched so that's it for this binder let's go on to the next one all right so i think there's some in here as well so let's check it out uh family time i did not use so nothing here car needs um also have not used yet um and there <laughs> there was a few videos ago where i made a joke about this envelope um and ever since then it's just I have to stop myself from actually saying the full carnitas <laughs> um, I know a fellow budgeter I dream with Cindy agreed she's the one that brought it up and I was like you know what that's true <laughs> sorry guys so if you do get reminded of that as well and you know what I'm talking about go ahead and drop this emoji down in the comments and I'll know that you actually <laughs> went through and saw my little joke that I had but yeah so no nothing in car needs House needs, did not touch it as well. Clothing, I have not gone shopping for that or the kids, sorry. Holidays, um, I know I need to get a new envelope because holidays is holidays slash gifts, which obviously is not working out because I have to keep coming back and touching. Um, so I will go ahead and fix that in the near future. But for now, holidays, I actually spent a little more than I had, so there will definitely be an IOU. So I'm just gonna throw in whatever's in here, which is 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78 dollars. Um, the total was 173 minus 78 dollars. That means I have a 95 dollar amount IOU. So when I do start cash stuffing again, um, I will make sure to keep track of that and when I do come to that amount I will just take it out of my envelope and pay it back that way everything's caught up and no more delays but fortunately holidays is empty now daycare and school have not used it yet I will start giving my mom who is my babysitter more money now that I'm working full-time so she's seen them more often um, so I will pay her beginning September just don't know what date I'm gonna ask her what benefits her more um, adulting nothing Roth IRA um, I obviously do not use or take anything out I have maxed out my contributions so for now I'm just stuffing I'll let you guys know in, in another video about that and then Costco has been capped. I don't need to make a payment until February. So let's look at the next one. All right, let's get these last ones out of the way. My Jasmine personal envelope does not need to get anything taken out. I do need to condense and most likely just stuff already. It's been a while since I stuffed the envelope that this goes to. I'm pretty sure some of y'all forgot because it's been so long. Trust me, I forgot to. Um, spending, nothing. Liliana and Aaliyah won't get touched, so nothing from there. Jazzy's Rewards, I did purchase something. Um, it's something for a giveaway I'm thinking of doing when I hit the 500. 
um, I I have all the stuff I cannot wait to go ahead and announce that giveaway with all the items um, but that will be coming soon as well so for that I need to take out $48 let's just oh yes I have $8 I was just gonna throw in a 50. So five, six, seven, eight, 20, 40. 48 from Jazzy's. And now I still have 50, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86. 86 in my rewards. And I believe this is the last one, Hustles. So for my Hustles envelope, my transaction was $53. Hustles uh, pertain for both YouTube, because you know, like I said, I'm gonna do a giveaway, so I wanted to buy some things. So for YouTube and also my side business. So that came out to a total of $53. Um, let's see, do I have dollars? Nope. So let's do a five. These down. That's 45 and a 10 or 55. And so I'm putting in 55 for a 53 payment. So I just need to get two dollars back. And now Hustle still has 100, 200, 253. 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 502 dollars. I don't really have a goal to get this to, but I do know that it's not going to stay all in here and I will be using these to cash off other envelopes. We'll see. Nothing in choice, nothing in AR, and investing. So, seems like that is it, y'all. Let's go ahead and total these numbers up. All right, we are back with this. So, I said we started off with $2,011. The total of the unstuffing was 367 So it should be a total of 23,000, I mean, whoa, 2,378. All right, this is where I start getting a little nervous because I'm not quite sure if I will get to that. So let's hope that's the end total. Leave it right there. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seventeen hundred, all hundreds. Let's keep track over here. Oh, and you guys notice I don't have my pink one. It's on a little break. You know, my daughter was playing with it, so some of the little stuff got messed up. So I brought my backup calculator. This is this is um, its debut, I guess you could say. So 1700 plus 51, 52, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40. So 340, we're at 2240. I have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, plus 80, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, we're at 2,360, so I'm hoping there is $18 in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 
Ooh, I got it right. So yeah, so that is how, you know, I keep track of my expenses to pay myself back. Like I mentioned, I am a credit card user. I try to reap them benefits. And those rewards always tend to come in at the right time because they end up being my buffer money. And that way I don't have to take it away from my income. Um, thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking around. Like I said, I will try to be on here as much as possible or more frequently than this last month. So any, any comments? Feel free to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.